morning, everyone. Sunday, Missouri State hosted a fan appreciation day at JQH Arena. A season high 6,500 fans saw one heck of a ball game with Illinois State. If you were among them, you will never forget being there. And when you see these photos by Matt Turrer, you will understand why Ryan Kreklow said after the game, quote, I am going to remember that moment for the rest of my life. This game was a battle for second place in the Missouri Valley standings. Bears going for five wins in their last six. But the Redbirds, tough team, man. Phil Fain with a monster slam early on gave ISU an 8-5 first half lead. Next possession, Ryan Kreklow. His second three-pointer of the game ties the game up at eight. Then Kabir Muhammad driving the baseline, finding a wide open Darian Scott for the slam. Bears up 12-8, six minutes into the game. But Illinois State takes the lead into halftime. Malik Yarborough, a pull-up three beats the buzzer. Redbirds up 32-27. ISU still causing all kinds of trouble in the second half. Zach Copeland, a steal in the backcourt, scores with about four minutes left. Redbirds 56, Bears 50. But the Bears stayed in this thing. 10 seconds to go, down five. Josh Webster, coast to coast. Bucket and one. The free throw was good. 65-63. Seven seconds left. Keandre Cook knocks away the inbound pass. Mad scramble. Who wants it at half court? The ball finds Jared Dixon. He takes a dribble and heaves it. Drive home safely. Half court buzzer beater shocks the Redbirds. 66-65. Dixon's miracle moves the Bears into second place in the Valley. It is surreal. That's all I can say, man. Um, I just I just credit to my teammates really um, we just kept fighting to the end I mean the game seemed out of hand um, they looked like they were going to pull away then we got a couple layups and then it was a big steal I think uh, Dre got it yeah Dre got it he got a really big steal then the ball was just going everywhere as soon as I let it go I was like this this got a chance man it's either going to Bank in, bank in, rim out. I was like, it's on target, and then it's backboard. Well, you know, we always talk about playing for 40. Again, I think it couldn't have no more deserving kid. J Jared Dixon is just, and I've said this repeatedly since I've been here, we need a roster full of those type of kids. That might have been the greatest finish in the history of JQH Arena. With your Monday Morning Sports, I'm Dan Malloy.